Nineteen years ago today, Sri Lankans woke up to a tragedy. Never have Sri Lankans ever experienced the wrath of the ocean as they did on Boxing Day in 2004. On that fateful day, an undersea earthquake of magnitude 9.1 on the Richter scale struck off the coast of Sumatra, triggering a tsunami. The strongest of the tsunami waves, which amassed near the island of Sumatra at around 6.58 a.m., reached Sri Lanka in two hours at a speed of 800 kilometers per hour. Sri Lanka was impacted at around 9.26 a.m. Massive waves claimed the life of over 35,000 Sri Lankans and destroyed property worth millions within a matter of minutes. The ruthless tides wrecked away unforgiving havoc, sparing none who stood in its way. A staggering 230,000 lives across Indonesia, Sri Lanka, India, the Maldives and Thailand were claimed by the tragic tsunami. In memory of everyone who lost their lives to the ocean that day, Sri Lankans embraced the tradition of observing a two-minute silence each year on the 26th of December. This year too, a two-minute silence was observed from 9.25 a.m. to 9.27 a.m. Mama Yavasta and Gutter, Apada Kalamanakar Namadjestani, Sahakara Jakshavaria, Visala Mahanur, Pilibandavapi Banaputi, Ahalati Butter, Mamadeka, Roha Lasane, Limahan Pradeshaval, Malamini, Tuni, Gurlati and Waika to Gurlaka to Gurlakinala, Ojas Galana Malamini, Badagin, Suki, Nyati, Velapina, Kari, Matasia Sindutua, Sanka Lake and Ekaturana Sudus Tatuak, Timpinera. Avasani, the Abime, Ilak Kamada Mudra, the Buama, Sekamara, Kutitra, Pasi, this Pandahak, Mirgipua had theatre, Pandahak, Naturdang had theatre. Nineteen years ago, in 2004, 1,270 unsuspecting individuals were travelling by train as the waves hit the tracks at Peralia. 144 individuals still remain unaccounted for. Honouring their memory, a special train was operated from the Colombo Fort Railway Station to Beliata today. The engine of the train which felt the brunt of the waves in 2004 was used for the special train service operated today. The train stopped at the Parali railway station for around 10 minutes for the people to pay their respects and place floral tributes at the Parali Tsunami Memorial statue. The sea may have washed their lives away, but their memory remains fresh in our hearts. In the meantime, Abhilash Jairaj, widely known as Baby81, who claimed international fame now, is 19 years old. Abhilash, who was subsequently rescued, was washed away by the tsunami waves at the tender age of just two months. Nine sets of parents came forward to claim him, and following a lengthy battle, his parents finally secured parental custody of baby Abhilash. Abhilash, together with his family, paid respects to those who lost their lives to the ocean in 2004.